What's up YouTube? Welcome to a brand new video and today will be another full day of eating but this time it's going to be a little bit different because I'm going to try out vegan. So why am I trying out vegan? Because of the health benefits and also because I'm open to new things and I always want to try out new things. So I think it will be fun for you guys to see how you can still get results and eat enough protein while being vegan. I'm not doing this because I'm never going to touch meat again, because I'm never going to eat chicken again and never going to touch milk again. This is just something I want to try out and see for myself how it is and it's just an experience basically and it's also a great way for you guys to see how you can still get results while eating like a vegan. It's now one o'clock and I'm having my first meal which will be a smoothie. After that I'm going to the gym and I do an upper workout session. So I'm going to show you guys all the meals today but it's also my refi day which means I get to eat a lot more calories than normal. Um, I'm having a lot of cravings lately and I haven't been doing a refi day for over two weeks and I'm really noticing that I'm having cravings and that I'm getting very hungry so I'll get to eat a bit more than normal. I'm doing it very carefully because I don't want to overeat and gain weight. So it's now time for that delicious smoothie I'm going to get, and I'm going to show you guys exactly how I make it. So let's start this video. some creatine I actually quit creatine for two weeks um, there are some rumors out there that um, when you're only taking creatine in each day that your body starts creating less creatine itself nobody knows if that's true or not the science is not there studies have shown that this is not the case but still in order to just make sure uh, I quit creatine for two weeks and now I'm having creatine again so um, this is my way of making sure that everything is fine. There aren't enough studies about this topic. So I just wanted to make sure and that is why I quit creatine for two weeks and now I am taking creatine in again. This is a great way for me to maintain my strength during my cut. But creatine is also a really good option if you are bulking because you will get a, a bit more strength. So I'm taking some creatine along with me. You can take this in after your workout or pre-workout or during your workout. I'm taking it in during my workout. This is a non-flavored creatine. So I'm also adding some syrup, zero sugar, which is berry and strawberry flavor. Arrived at the gym and I just want to quickly say that, that smoothie is freaking delicious. If I could give it a review, I would give it a 9.5 out of 10. The taste is really amazing, and the protein powder, which is normally not that great, is actually very nice together with the smoothie. So, definitely a recommendation because it's very healthy, a great source to eat a lot of veggies while still really liking it. So with the bench press I noticed that my wrist still hurt, I had an injury there. So I quickly switched it up, I used dumbbells instead of the bar and that uh, gave me a lot less pain in my wrist. So for the time being I'm only going to train my chest with dumbbells because of my uh, weak wrist. Okay guys, it's now time for the post workout meal. It's buckwheat with a lot of beans, I never have made it myself. So I'm very curious, I've never tried out buckwheat. So I'm very curious and uh, let's start cooking guys. Let's make this meal. Meal number two. The buckwheat is now cooking and also making some uh, paprika in order to get a lot more veggies in. And I'm also adding some beans. So I have no idea what this is going to be, 
but we'll see in a minute. So I'm also going to add some tofu in order to get some protein in. So basically all I did was put everything together in the pan and I have still no idea what the hell I'm doing but it looks delicious so we'll see in a minute. There is the end result. Um, it's actually quite good but you have to add a lot of spices and a lot of sauces in order to really enjoy it. So I added some soy sauce and some ketchup sauce and a lot of pepper and a lot of other stuff in order to make it really good. By the way, this is a tip of mine, curcuma. This spice adds a lot of flavor and it's actually quite healthy as well. Yeah guys, I'm gonna crash this meal. It's very big in volume, so this will fill me up a lot. And uh, I'll see you guys later with the next meal. I stayed in for the next meal, which is vegan hamburgers, which you'll have to make yourself. So I never have tried these before, so I'm very curious. Yeah, I'm gonna make these burgers. See you guys later. I'm also having some potatoes with it. This is with a different peas, couscous, paprika, carrot and uh, different spices. So translation will be down here because I don't know how to say everything in English. But this is a vegan burger and you have to make it yourself. Boil this stuff for another 10 minutes, so we'll just have to wait a bit more longer before we can make the burgers. Yes, yes, next meal. Um, I would not recommend to make this yourself. They sell uh, these packages in Holland and I do not recommend them because they give you a lot of work and it really takes a lot of time before you make your own hamburgers. I'm going to take a quick bite in order to let you guys know how it tastes. Well, it is a very healthy burger. Taste is not that great. You can really taste that it's from beans and from other stuff. So I do not really recommend to have this burger. Um, but it is a very solid choice if you want healthy nutrients in your body. But it's definitely not the best burger I've tasted, which is vegan. So I'm just going to have some cruisely tonight and an apple. And that will be my two snacks for the evening. Did I really enjoy being vegan today? Well, not that much, uh, but that's also because of the meals I made. You can of course make a lot more stuff when being vegan. You can have some beans with rice, or you can eat some tortillas with beans and stuff. There are a lot of options out there. And this is just me trying to have some vegan meals. I never made them myself. It was kind of an experiment, but um, I did really enjoy that smoothie this morning. So I don't have any final verdict. Um, if you want to try out vegan, try it out yourself. There are a lot of options available, a lot of meals you can make. You can also make your burgers yourself. There are a lot of options out there, so definitely worth investigating. And being vegan is a lot more healthier than just eating meat and dairy. Uh, this was just an experiment, some different meals. Uh, I didn't really like all the meals, to be honest with you guys, but um, it was a nice experiment. The most enjoyable meal of today was the smoothie in the morning. I really love the smoothie. I'm definitely going to make those a lot more during the week. Uh, crazy amount of vitamins and crazy amount of veggies. And in the future I'm also going to do another video in which I'm only going to eat vegan meals. And in that future video I'm going to make a lot of different meals. And I'm going to try out a lot more different stuff. Because this was just an experiment and I'm just trying out some different meals. And I didn't really like them that much. but. There are a lot more options available when being vegan. So I'm now going to enjoy those burgers and those potatoes. Um, see you in the next video. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Um, please subscribe to my channel. And see you in the next video. Bye guys.